Tesla has released a new update which shows how Tesla owners can improve the supercharging speed. This is a very useful update, friends. A few different features have been uncovered in Tesla's latest software update, version 2024.2.6. One of them is the supercharging improvement, which, if used wisely, can help Tesla owners to improve their supercharging speed and overall experience. It will also extend the battery life. Now the Tesla app website spotted the release notes and the improvements of the new 2024.2.6. Thus, according to one of the improvements Tesla made in this release, Tesla will now let you know how much preconditioning time the battery needs before going to supercharger station. If the driver puts a supercharger location in the navigation system, the vehicle starts to precondition its battery pack for more efficient charging on the way there. In other words, if you arrive at a supercharger and your battery is too cold to DC fast charge, the vehicle will now display how long it will take for the battery to warm up until DC fast charging begins. This is one of the main reasons why the driver should always use the vehicle's navigation system to navigate a to a supercharger. The vehicle will look at the battery's temperature and the supercharger's charging capability to determine if the battery needs to be warmed up to help reduce charging times. Another improvement to supercharging in this update is that the vehicle will now automatically warm up the charge port. This again requires that the driver the supercharger location as a destination in the navigation system warming up the charge port will keep it freezing shut uh, uh, in extreme temperatures a couple of uh, weeks ago i was test driving mercedes uh, eqe and i remember the first time when i went to supercharger i set the supercharger destination in the navigation of the vehicle and by the time i got to supercharger my uh, charging speed was very fast because the battery was already preconditioned and ready to receive a lot of uh, power in a speedy manner the second time, because I already knew the supercharger destination, I didn't uh, put the vehicle's, uh, uh, my destination in the vehicle's navigation system and I just drove there. And guess what? My speed of charging was uh, far slower. This is very important. This is why very important for Tesla owners on how to speed up your supercharging experience. When you go to supercharger, even though if you know the location very well, still, put the destination in your Tesla's navigation system. So the battery starts preconditioning, starts warming up by the time you get there. This is Armin Haria from TorqueNews.com. If you like this report, please give us thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. And subscribe to our channel if you are your first time. God bless you. And let's continue the destination. Tell us about your charging experience. How do you fast charge? And how do you, what are the things that you do to make sure your Tesla is ready for charging or your electric vehicle is ready for charging and you get the, the fastest possible speed at charging station? God bless you. And I'll see you soon in our next report.